Okay. Oh gosh. Oh. This is gonna be a ramp for two hours. Yeah. It's probably gonna take me a second to think about all this because there's so much to say. Uh, well, I hate it. If I came with, to school without a shirt on, they'd say, go put on a, your gym shirt or go put on a shirt. They, and if a girl came to school with, say, a tank top on, they'd dress code her. Like, like, don't show up naked. Like, don't show up <laughs> in a bikini. Like, I understand that. But, like, if you lift up your shirt and you see your stomach, it's like... I'm just not fine on how inconsistent they are. I mean, it's just it's, a it's not an invitation for people to rate me. You dress the way you want to. It's self-expression. Like I got dress coded for wearing this exact shirt because of the I think the bra strap. It's really bad. I read on our school's website that teachers' variations may change, and that. But it's not like a guy's going to get turned on from my shoulder or a little piece of, like, piece of my stomach. Say that they should have the dress code packed on solid. Now I remember, um, at lunch talking about that. And if a girl is, as you put it, more curvy, they do get dress code more often. Generally because it's harder to, uh, fit into the same clothes. They're trying to break the dress code just so they can feel like they're rebelling. Well, I don't think like an inch more or less fabric really is gonna change a guy's mind on how the girl looks in it or something. Yeah. Some people like dress code you based on one thing and then other people dress code you based on the other. Like a lot of the stuff people get dress coded for, but I still think... Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Definitely. Is there grade biased, gender biased, group biased? Like a dude could like come to school wearing like, they could come to school with like a naked girl on their t-shirt and they wouldn't be dress coded. If like a girl comes to school with like a crop top, right away they're gone. Because they're like, I don't have time for everybody, but you only have time for the people who are not super skinny or have more curves. A guy would never get dress coded. <laughs> the ideal goal of the right to wear what you want to school is not so we can like be walking around the school in our bras. It's just so we feel like we're not like so enclosed in this box of what we're supposed to fulfill.